good with everybody thank y'all for checking in for another video man this is a pretty general day i'm just pulling up on people i'm just trying to stay consistent and keep the content coming with y'all man i know all y'all ready to see this car right here this one man i'm out here uh checking some stuff out because i need to buy some stuff in uh i noticed i want to make sure the brake system good excuse the wind or too on the car so i was just looking at all the brake components and i noticed on this i'm gonna buy because i'm about to uh about to spend a little on uh, about to spend a little money a little mini bag you know to get the uh i don't think it caught me. man safety safety first with me i don't care what nobody talking about it's a budget bill but you know what i'm saying you don't go budget on your on your safety yes just what it is i'm probably finna pull up on um where i am finna pull up on don't at don't panic customs his other shop so y'all probably get to see a little stuff over there but I was up underneath the hood and noticed I was looking at all the brake components, so I'm gonna buy this too, the master cylinder. See that ain't even tight. You know, that low, but it won't even it won't even bite no more, so I'm gonna buy I'm gonna buy that new whole entire master cylinder. Oh uh, and I was just checking over the wiring and stuff, cause we we about to actually get ready to drop the motor in. I told y'all it's rolling now. I'm about to put the motor together i think the crank and bottom end is together i just gotta film it he ain't here right now the shot closed so yeah well shot closed so he'll be here later maybe i'll get that video done for y'all but just just i know everything ain't gonna be exciting all the time but i'm trying to stay consistent for y'all man so appreciate me for that but i'm taking over the wire and everything call it easier to put this stuff on while the motor is out so i'm gonna go ahead and get this master cylinder and i told y'all i'm gonna do drums and all this stuff uh, we're going to paint all this. Everything going to be nice and neat up underneath. Black. See, it little stuff like this. I'm going to have to tighten all that up. I don't want no wiring. You don't want no wiring. Crazy, nothing touching, arcing. None of that stuff. So that's what I've been doing out here. And I ain't, I didn't turn the camera on, so I figured I'd catch this for y'all. And this is another way you can tell you got a 9C12. Comes with a transmission cooler, too. That's a factory GM cooler. It come out right here. This is your cooler lines. Um, but uh, another cooler, my bad. You got a cooler built in the radio, most car. But um, yeah, like I said, general takeover. I'm going to get this, I'm gonna order all this stuff. Go how that wheel and auto zone. But this enough. I'm gonna pull up at Don't Panic Customs, so they probably be the next clip. Then I'm gonna pull up on my cousin, Little Crazy Whips Addiction. See what he got going on, and you know it's just a general day. So let me get y'all opinion too, cause I'm kind of, I'm kind of feeling y'all now. <laughs> Some people already said, should I keep these seats and I'm going to keep them, you know, get the car running, but should I just look for a factory box Chevy interior? Just let me know. But I, I'm definitely going to have a custom console coming. Y'all will see that and y'all going to see who's going to do that. But uh, drop in the comments what y'all think I should do about the interior. <clears throat> but I'll see y'all in a minute. Hey, y'all look. I just pulled up on my cousin. Hey, what, what you got going on today? Hey, man. <laughs> Yo, hey, look. Hey, I had a little leak in my old uh, oil pan gas. It would pinch a little bit. So I want to get all that done. You know what I'm saying? Before I put everything back on. And like I said, I went on. My rally came today. You know what I'm saying? You know, I ain't going to paint these. I'm going to leave these prime down gray. Whatever, whatever car, whatever color my car is, I'm going to paint it on the rim, man. You know, I got a big chrome cinnamon cap on them. So I'm going to paint the right here. Do you know how to? White little um, on the tire, so y'all gonna see me riding around like that right there for a minute. So he got new rims and stuff. Hey, you gonna vlog this right here? You gonna you gonna make a vlog of this or what you gonna? Well, I know. I Go, might, wait, I might look. Vlog. He said he said gonna be a quick job. I think gonna take him by. He gonna he gonna be tomorrow. It's, still <laughs> it's a quick job because like I said, I I took it out by myself with a motor in. I jacked the motor up, took the uh, motor, uh, mount bolts out. Jacked the, Just um, picked the motor up. Put the motor up. Yeah, yeah. Oil pan. pan. It's it easy, man. Yeah, it really ain't though. All jokes aside, though, it really ain't. It really ain't a hard job. I mean, I dropped the oil pan gasket on the side of the street before. He just picked the motor up. I said, take the motor mount bolts up, pick it up, then it'll clear, and you can get it out. So. That what he got going man, on, man. Man, why you showing my motor, man? <laughs> <laughs> I, I, I just playing, I just playing, man. I just playing, y'all. <laughs> <laughs> like I said, it ain't that pretty, man. You know, you can look at it all day, but you would never know what hey, side of it. Hey, look, at the time they seeing it, though, they dropped their vlog, man. 
I mean, I dropped that vlog. Tell him, boy, hey, Cedro like to kill them. <laughs> what you doing, like? man? You remember when we went on the ride yesterday? Yeah. <laughs> when Cedro was driving. Uh-huh. <laughs> In the Camaro. Yeah. You forgot, man. I know you ain't forgot that fast. Yesterday, we did the ride rest video. When Ced, Cedro drove the car. Yeah. <laughs> hey, Cedro like the boy. Hey, man. Ooh, wee. What? I ain't see that, man. Huh? I ain't see that. Oh yeah, he ain't saw it at the time there. Yeah, see. The video up, but oh yeah, but he ain't even saw it, man. I meant to bring the clip over here and show it to him, yeah, but hey look, if y'all saw that video, y'all by now y'all should have been and looked at it. If you haven't, go look at it. But if y'all ain't saw that video, man, go look at that. Boy, I'm talking about that's the first time I ever been scared in my own car. Like, boy, that's a show, so I'ma uh I'ma catch y'all in a minute. We're gonna still head over to Don't Panic uh Customs and then see what he got going on. Then I check back in with y'all. All right, y'all. We checking back in. Pulled up over here at Don't Panic Customs. Uh, so we're about to get with Brady. See what Brady got going on today. Uh, I'm gonna turn the camera back around because I don't know what I can and can't show over here right now. So get in here. Then we'll see what's going on. So I get with y'all in a minute. All right. So we over here at Don't Panic Customs. They got the green light for my uh. My bro Brady, he pulling some exclusive stuff over. I was finna put him on camera, give him a shout out, but we can't get that on camera. <laughs> man, he, he gonna, uh, y'all gonna wanna take it out. That's all I wanna say, man. Y'all gonna wanna take his channel out, boy. But he working on this. Man, he said he had the car. You had a, what you said, a week, a couple days? Yeah, a week. A week. Yeah, Brady done had the car a week, and he already got it ready for paint. I'm just telling y'all this car, good turnaround. He put the motor in and stuff. Did all that? Well, we ain't gonna do that. I don't know if he want that on there, but oh yeah, you. Oh, he good. Okay. But yeah, he put the motor in for him and everything, so he did that, and he about to paint it. He said about to paint it till tomorrow. He said you paint tomorrow. Yeah, tomorrow. I might, I might end up doing it tonight. So yeah, he hard work. Y'all were asking about it in the comment too. His number on the screen right now. Uh, take his channel out and his uh, channel on the screen too. And he got a video dropping today. You working on so today or tomorrow? You working on your car, ain't you? Yeah, well, nah, I'm gonna do mine probably tonight. Tonight? Yeah. You gonna film what? That gonna be the next video coming or this right here? Another one on this one? Nah, uh, I'm, I'm gonna do the uh, I'm gonna do the uh, 90 day video. 90 day, okay. So, yeah. I'm yeah. gonna check that out. Uh, so, look, at the time y'all watching this, y'all done saw uh, Don't Panic Customs video. So, this is Malibu. I'm showing on my channel. And man, I'm glad I'm glad he let me over here to see it call. He put together some sick whips. I'm telling you, he just now showing the world, but he been putting whips together. So y'all see the box, the mystery box on the floor. <laughs> By now y'all saw it, but y'all see the mystery box. Even if y'all ain't, you gotta go to his channel. You ain't saw it, man. His wheels is sick. Brand new them wheels sick, man. If you ain't saw it, go over to his channel and uh check that video out. He showed the wheels and stuff. He had went and picked them up, but yeah, they were starting out and uh you got that, he about to do everything to it, so. So it's gonna be, it's gonna be something to see, or uh, come together. And we just talking, y'all know, man, y'all know I keep, uh, y'all know I keep everything, everything with, with my bros and all that, and supporting everybody, so y'all might see the, um, uh, the budget box over here more than likely, or whatever on them. I told you I'd probably put a, put something on it. Not nothing expensive, cause it's a budget. You know, it's a budget budget type setup, so. Uh, but yeah, man, that's it. He got, like I said, he got that coming. I really see that on his channel. Cause look, I don't know about y'all, I have post notifications on, on everybody's channel. Soon, soon as he drop, I see it. It come to my phone, I check it out. And uh, same thing with Don't Panic, uh, Old School Kings, everybody. So, I'm probably gonna slide over to the shop, man. We're gonna see it mess with my motor a little bit or something, and then, I'll catch y'all in a minute. Alright y'all, so about to close this thing out, just made it back to the house. I told you it wasn't too much going on, but I'm just trying to stay consistent. It's about to be some talking, but this really why I shot this video today. I just didn't want to set the camera down and just make it a straight talking video. So I went went out, you know, linked up with some of the bros and all that to try to get y'all a little something instead of just sitting the camera down talking. But this really why the whole purpose of this video basically. Look, what um at the end of the day, everything I shoot on here is something I truly want to do, something I'm truly passionate about when it comes to these cars, cause you don't do your cars for nobody. I don't care. 
I don't care if you're a YouTube creator. I don't care if any of y'all aspiring to be a creator. Do not get caught up in shooting content solely for what people want to see. Always do what you want to do in your heart at the end of the day. That's why it's called YouTube. But everybody watching is a part of what I do. And I really do appreciate everybody. So I'm open to people's input. I take criticism well. You know, as long as people keep it respectful and all that. But, okay, with the budget box, what do y'all think? I'm asking for y'all advice. And y'all know I read my comments. I do read my comments. So somebody drop advice. I know they made it to the end. But uh, as far as that box... My original plans were to, I'm still keeping it budget. I'm keeping it budget with the motor. It's not a hot motor. Y'all know I'm a, I'm a racer. I could have went boss to the wall on the motor and built a, a serious small block, aftermarket block and all that. But I kept it budget with the motor. Uh, I originally was going to keep the paint job the same, even though the clear coat peeling and stuff like that. It needs, it needs to be painted in the interior. But now I'm kind of thinking... I'm kind of feeling like I need to do something. I was going to change the carpet anyway. But do y'all feel like I should paint the car? Should I go ahead and paint the car, man? And like I said earlier, should I at least get factory Caprice interior, try to find the factory interior, you know, get that little, get that stuff right car. I feel like it still can be done on a budget and not break the bank, but I still want to keep this realistic to where the everyday working man or woman can be able to do what I'm doing to this car. That's why I got off not off brand rims or whatever which i actually like the rims i would not bought them if i didn't like them but i still want to keep it budget oriented so do y'all feel like i should paint the car and change the seats and stuff like that you know doing little detail stuff instead of my original plan was to keep the car the same color and put the wheels on and just hey ride out i'm gonna have fun with it regardless but i'm just what y'all think man seriously i'm gonna read this comment do y'all think i should paint that car and all of that and all? Uh, should I change the interior, you know? Stuff like the brakes and stuff. I was going to do that new anyway because it, it is safety. That's safety, like I said. Uh, but I want y'all opinion on that. Should I put a system in the car? Like, what what would be going too much for the everyday man or woman? Like, the per the person that's watching now, y'all y'all who watching now, the stuff I'm doing to this car, is it realistic for y'all? Like, can y'all relate to it? As in, you feel like you can do it too? You know, it ain't out, it ain't out of pocket. It ain't out of pocket for y'all watching. That's what I'm asking. Uh, so, I don't know, man. I mean, I'm leaning towards I want to paint it and stuff, but I want to get y'all, see how y'all feel about it. If I end up really feeling like, hey, I want to paint it, I just paint it. But I keep it budget-oriented. But what y'all think, man? Uh, that's the whole reason I shot this video. Kind of see what y'all feel on this car. How y'all like, the di or y'all liking the direction the car going and everything. Cause I'm really excited. The car is about to have oil pressure very soon, which is why I'm having this talk car. It's time to get on the cosmetic stuff now. Like, it's about to roll. So, uh, I don't know, man. I, I just, I really want y'all to drop a comment below and see what y'all think, car. Y'all think I should do, because I'm going to read them. I'm going to read them, but I didn't want, like I said, I didn't want to set the camera down and just be talking and all that. I want to show y'all different scenery, so I went to Don't Panic Customs. And uh, I pulled up on my cousin, see what he had going on. Everybody kind of just moving around working today. But, uh, yeah, man, just let me know. Let me know, man. And hopefully, in that video, I'll be showing y'all the engine and stuff. Because I do want to get into that, teach y'all some stuff with the engine. If you missed the uh, cheapskate build when I built my S10, I was very detailed with that. And, uh, yeah, I'm still going to get a G-Body. As soon as they box it, yeah, yeah, boom. I'm going to get a G-Body. So, we're going to have that coming. Um... Uh, but yeah, that's it, man. A short little video. Hope y'all enjoyed it. I, like I said, I know it wasn't a lot of action, but I'll catch y'all on the next one. I'm going to read the comments, and I'm out.